Hey people, Duncan here once again. I want to talk to you about our country in dire need. So first and foremost though, please subscribe to my channel, like my videos, comment in the box below, and hit that bell for notifications. You know, for far too long, we've sat back and we've allowed our country to fall. We've allowed our country to be ran by people who no longer have the will of the American people at their best interest. Every time we turn around, we see scandals like the Clinton Foundation, the Uranium One. Every time we turn around, we can see certain subversions that have been installed and empowered upon us since the very beginning of this country. It's something I talk about a lot. We've allowed the government to literally create the chaos to start the division that has led us to the giant need for government control. The Liberal Party is not just to blame. When President Trump stepped up to the microphone and said he's draining the swamp, what that means is he's draining this country of the corrupt politicians looking to steal from the American people, looking to abuse their powers to hand their rights and the rights of the Americans away and over. What they're talking about is to stand up against those same politicians looking to rip this country down. The faith, the, the foundation, our laws, the people looking to rip this country apart because they don't like what America stands for. There's an agenda in play where America is under attack. One of the key weapons by the opposition is subversion. It's subversion into corruption. They're using any means necessary on both sides of the fence. This isn't just a, a Republican or a Democrat thing. This isn't about any, this is about merely money and power. These politicians get in the office, they run and give themselves vote, uh, raises. They hit higher salaries, they're more in charge of our budget, they pass bills that have the, that lather their foundations with personal money. Before you know it, people go in office with next to nothing and come out of, come out of office as millionaires. You have to wonder, how are you representing the American people if you're making money off of them? This country was once designed for politics to be ran by volunteers. People who went to work, who ran their businesses, who got off of work, and went after work down to the town halls to figure out what to do for this country, how to make it work. They didn't pay people to come in and to represent people from other countries. You see, the idea of term limits is a necessity to prevent this. If you install a, a federal term limits at every level of this government, then this would prevent long-time governors, politicians, senators, congress, president, all of them, it would prevent them from stepping in, from holding office, making friends in every aspect at every level, and being able to get away with just about anything. We see this right now with the Clintons. We see how far they've dug this hole and how far they've allowed it to go. Wake up, America. This movement is about the people. It's about the people holding our government accountable. The reason I decided to run as Oregon's next governor is because for far too long the current governor has been ran by the corrupt. For far too long the American, the Oregon taxpayers have been held second, third place while promoting illegals and so-called refugees. For far too long our cities, our towns throughout Oregon have dried up. Our people have lost their homes, their jobs, their businesses. All because career politicians lobby 
for big city and big city votes. For far too long, the Liberal Party has been able to get into our colleges and subvert our youth into this anti-American socialist idea. For far too long, we have allowed this tyranny to continue. We've allowed these corrupt politicians to dictate our laws, and we can't do it anymore. Please stand with me as Oregon's next governor. Please stand with us, MAGA Nationwide, as we attempt to not only redeem Oregon, but to truly make America great again, to truly make this a movement for the people, by the people, so that we, the people, can once again control the greatest country on earth. So thank you for your time. I hope you enjoyed the message. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Like the video. Hit that bell for more notifications and comment in the box below uh, if you have anything to add. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed. Peace. Duncan out.